Good afternoon. Some years ago, I fell in love with food, and um, I studied sustainability here in Switzerland. And as you can think now, I'm work with, with work uh, with uh, food sustainability. And food is really, really important to me because apart from keeping me alive, food makes up a great part of my day. I have to buy food, I have to cook food, I have to eat it. But food also makes me healthy. Food can prevent diseases, can sometimes even cure diseases. But most importantly, food makes me happy. Food makes me happy every day and many times a day. And do you know that something is wrong without, with, with our, our food? Well, you know because it has been said already. But I want to ask you, a question, do you know how, many, how much food do you eat per year? Do you have an idea? What does that mean, how much food do we eat? So, each day we have available more than two kilos of food per person in Switzerland. And this is an average also for men, for women, but also children, babies, meaning that myself, a grown-up man, probably I eat more than one ton of food a year. Unfortunately, that's not the case. One third of the food that we have available is being lost. 300 kilos per person per day. And it's lost from farm to fork. It's lost during processing, during retail. But the bad news are that half of this food is wasted by us consumers at home because we bought too much. If we look at the big picture, at the population of Switzerland, this makes up to more than two million tons. And if we take all this food and put it in garbage trucks, it will be in a row 140,000 garbage trucks in a line from here, from Bern, to Madrid, that's a lot of waste. Yes, it's beautiful food, but this food waste is, has consequences. has consequences on our, our environment, because by producing food that we wasted, we're wasting also resources, land, water, energy. And it's incredible to know that we waste food while at the same time, every day, one billion people are going to bed hungry, still. So, you may ask yourselves, why is this happening? There are many reasons to this. Actually, at the beginning, at the farm, some potatoes are too small or too big, so they don't enter the value chain. At, at the supermarket, they have too big quantities that are not been sold, so they have to be thrown out. Or, as the example before, we go shopping hungry, we buy too much, and then food spoils in our fridges. But my question here is, is this really the reason why we're wasting food? All these small little reasons, yeah, it's, but what's the big picture behind it? We waste food because we can afford it. In Switzerland, as in other European and Western countries, we spend only 7% of our household budget in uh, food. We spend more money in transportation or even in insurances. But food, it's really, really important for us because without food, we would die. And food, a part of being just calories, it, the part of, of keeping us alive with calories, it's beautiful because Food is that element that brings us as a society together. We, as a family, as a community, have food in our culture. We love to eat. I, I could not tell you how to reduce food waste. I could not tell you that how not to go hungry and uh, when, you go, uh, when you buy and not to buy too much, how to store food, how to cook your leftovers, but I don't have enough time, so I want just to give you the one real solution for this problem. If we care about food, if we really know its real value, then 
we will not waste it because we'll get informed. Each one of you will go to the internet, will ask your parents, and will discover on how not to food waste. And we'll think about, we'll plan. So it's such an important part of our lives, and we have to care about it. And I want to show you how really important it is. This is my family. What better time do I have to spend with my family than at, at the table, eating together, sharing experiences together? Is there any other way of a mom to show love to their children than cooking them a wonderful dinner? When you love someone, what do you do? You offer chocolates, you invite to dinner, you invite for a coffee. And imagine my daughter, her birthday party without a chocolate cake. Imagine a wedding party without wonderful food. Imagine that you don't have taste, that you don't taste the food you're eating. It's, it's a, a huge pleasure. So food, a part of making us alive, food is making us happy. And I could I talk now about food waste, but I could go on and talk about other problems of our food system. I could say how important it is to buy local food, to eat seasonal food, to reduce our consumption of animal products. But the solution also to all those problems lies on the same solution for food waste. If we care about the food, if we get informed about what we are eating, we will know, we'll discover, each one of you will discover what they should do best to reduce food waste or to render our food system more sustainable. And it's in our own responsibility to reduce the 300 kilos being wasted every year by each one of us. And it's also in our responsibility to render our food system more sustainable. But what do you have to do? You have to get informed. You have to care. If you really see how important food is, you'll start discovering by yourself what you can do. So, I love food. I think you also love food. Food makes me really happy, and now it's the time to start caring about it. Thank you, and anguete.